Hello everyone, Gerald here. Today we're going to start a new playthrough of Transport Fever 2 on a map I found on the workshop, which is supposed to represent the United States of America. I checked it out, looked really nice. So let's try it. It has the industries placed already. So it's going to be interesting to see what the map creator did with that. Other than that, the goal of the playthrough will be to to a reasonable extent, expand all the cities, see if we can connect all the industries, or just in general, enjoy the map and just see where, where we're going to go with it. I'm going to explain some of the things that I do from time to time, because I'm pretty sure there will be some questions. And I'm also going to show you now what uh, settings I'm going to apply for the playthrough or the map itself. So let's go. So first I'm going to load my mods. I have legacy vehicle here, which I think is necessary for the map. Open flora, add some trees and terrain uh, changes, achievements with mods. Parallel tracks saves a ton of time when you are placing tracks. Out to seek as well, saves a lot of time with signals. Out to places them on uh, tracks. Build with collisions because the game is annoying sometimes. I rarely use it, but sometimes it really helps. Performance tun tuning for performance reasons. Timetables, haven't really figured out how to use that yet, but it looked really cool in the workshop. Uh, yeah, some shaders, underpass, underground station, compact tunnels, larger modular station. This gives you uh, the option of building bigger stations. An industry tycoon, why? Because I just want to make sure I have the option to add industries if necessary, if the map creator didn't like balance them out very well. Uh, to the advanced station station settings, I guess I'm going to let all of this uh, like that. Dry, dry, American. The difficult is going to be hard. The maximum loan, I'm not going to touch. Loan, yeah, I don't think I'm going to touch any of those. But I'm going to increase those three because this is going to expand the cities a little bit more, making the game a little bit more interesting. And that's it. Other than that, in the basic settings, we're going to go to six cargo types. Again, to make it more interesting. Industry closure frequency would be never, because I don't want industries to be closed. And the density target is disabled because I don't want random industries to pop up. We have the industry tycoon mod if we need to place some. And I think that's it. And I'm going to start it real quick. And I'm going to see you there. One more thing I'm going to do is I'm very quickly going to wait for the timer to go to the year 1900 because the game is really slow and not that interesting in the beginning. And at the year 1900, we also have a uh, better loan uh, options and better vehicles, and it's going to be more interesting. So I will see you there. All right, here we are. It's January 1900. We have $30 million to work with. And the map looks very, very gorgeous, actually. Not super realistic, to be honest, because these mountains are <laughs> kind of low. To, uh, from what I know, that these mountains are much higher than that. Uh, these ones as well here. This is going to be cute when I have to build some rails. I will try to make it realistic and build tunnels, I guess. Um, so let's see what the plan is going to be. There is a lot of food production here, a lot of mountains, so that's definitely not going to be the start. Um, we have Mexico as well. We have some oil rigs here. Oh, the Bahamas, Cuba, Turks and Caicos Islands. No idea. Who went Bermuda, which I don't think it's here, really, but... Yeah, I'm not going to consult the map. Anyway, uh, hmm. let's also check the towns by size. New York, of course, very big. Los Angeles, not in our area. San Francisco, Washington as well. Houston is nearby, I think. Yeah. Miami, Boston. Yeah. I think the majority of my big cities are here on the east, which I think makes sense from real life as well. 
So I think this is going to be... I'm going to concentrate the development in the beginning. On top of everything, this is much flatter than on the other side of the map, so it's going to be much easier. I have some water here, which is definitely not like in real life, but whatever. Uh, I think in normal life, Atlanta is some water of a hub of uh, transportation. It has a lot of cities nearby, so it looks like a great location to start. Yeah, I think I convinced myself. Mm. Okay. And maybe we can connect to Charlotte. Charlotte? No idea how it's <laughs> pronounced, sorry. Uh, and then we can continue to Washington, New York, Boston. Then down here to Nashville, New Orleans, Houston, Tampa, Miami. Yeah, I think it's a great idea. There is some food production here as well that... I can set up. Looks uh, very promising. Okay, uh, let's first make a save. That's 1900. Let's make that the first save. If something goes wrong, just to <laughs> keep them up in this location because that was a lot of waiting to get here. And then I'm going to start. So, I see these two industries here. Hmm. I think what I'm going to do is... Oh, of course, they are low. Why not? I'm going to build their ownership. No, thank you, because I really, really don't want to pay uh, money. So, it has to go this way. Okay. Let's put something like this. I make it cheaper. 28. I saw 28 here. So I'm using the MNN uh, shift and MNN uh, keys to make it a little bit cheaper because every cent counts in this point of the game. Uh, yeah, now that's not necessary for sure. So I connect it here. Okay. And I'm going to do the same. 42, 40, 39. Yeah, 39 is the cheapest. One looks good. Okay. And here looks like a perfect location for the rail station, which is going to bring our passengers from Atlanta to everywhere else. And also, maybe in the future, potentially uh, used to uh, bring some of these materials. So, what I also want to do is tram track no for now and no ownership. I want to have here in the middle a big road just because I want to put my rail road with an upgraded road so that I don't have to destroy it later. And ah, so this is one of the mods as you can see many tracks, much uh, longer uh, length uh, in the building size and the building style is from the other mod. So as you can see, they are very, very helpful. I will need two tracks and we will start with 160 meters. That's definitely going to be enough in the beginning and I'm going to add it like this okay perfect as connections to everything here and it looks fairly good like that yeah I'm not forgetting anything right no okay let's put it the other thing I'm definitely going to need here is a bus and tram station we're going to start with electric for sure, and we're going to make it long because I expect a lot of passengers here with time. This road looks like it wants to go that way, so somewhere around here, so I can put the station right over here. Like this. Uh, because I already upgraded the road, I guess I can make it as close as possible. A little bit like this so that that road can connect properly. Perfect. What I'm also going to do is now I'm going to configure this and make another exit over here. And I'm going to try hmm, this street here 
looks like it wants to continue, but there's already a house there. So... Uh, I guess I'm going to build this. Uh, drum truck, electric, yeah. Definitely want to have that drum truck. Nah. Yeah, it's not very beautiful, but what can you do? Unless I just destroy this house and just continue. Yeah, why not? Let's make it symmetrical. Let's make it like this. So this is a bigger street, but that's going to cost me even more money, and I don't need that. 88. 87. 87 is the cheapest. Okay. And now I can connect it like this. this i think i like this very much okay so mm, looks looks beautiful actually uh one more thing i want to do here is i want to add passenger building because i expect a lot of passengers and i definitely don't want to lose my passengers this looks like a good placing because i think on the other side i also want to add my uh Tram depot over here. Like this can I actually maybe even add it here or something? Yeah, but takes too much space. I think that's good enough. Yeah, let's make it nice and symmetrical. And close as possible is fine because then oh but what if I decide to upgrade this road? Yeah. Let's actually upgrade it now to a bigger one. The biggest one. Like this. Okay. Costs some money, but helps long term. Big time. Okay, okay. So it starts to become ugly around here. So be over here. Okay, I like it. Okay, so now we have all the setup here. Ooh. Which is a little bit and it's not flat enough, but let's not make that a big problem. Okay. Uh, since I already started with the public transportation in this city, let's figure out where I'm going to put my bus and tram stations. So let's bring up this is the land use layer that's going to help me create my public transportation for Atlanta. So what I like to do is to have for each of the districts, and a district for me is like a, a area of certain type of uh, thing in the game, which is residential, commercial, or industrial. And it looks like the commercial area is forming up here very nicely. So this looks like a good place. For the residential, I think I'm going to choose here. This one, yeah, this one a question mark. It would be nice to have that connection, but I don't have it, so maybe it's not going to be there. Maybe it's going to be over here. Okay. And the residential is going to be. Yeah, these guys are going to be left out. But what can you do? I'm not going to add too many stations at this point of the game, for sure like this amazing okay so all the infrastructure is done now i just have to create the lines but that's going to be after we finish with the rest of the things uh and the next thing is going to be charlotte <laughs> i really don't know if i'm saying that correctly but it doesn't matter uh so uh Train here, train there. That's the question. I think if I put it here, yeah, I don't know where to put it because this might want to expand. So on this side, I guess it makes more sense to me. And why don't I just do it? Let's take this one. And connect these two. Oh, definitely not like that. Yep, that makes sense. 9,000, 8,000. Okay. 
Awesome. Oh, again, I forgot. I have to upgrade it. Uh, no, 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 thing. Thank you. Like this. Uh, and this has to be electric. Is it? Yep. Because we are going to use electric trams. And the next one is... Oh, yeah, you see, that's what I forgot. I wanted to add a large building size. Oh, that's going to be a recreation of the other station, I think. So this is going to be my station here. It looks good like this. Perfect. And then I also need to add the tram station on that side. Right over here looks good enough. Yeah. Maybe I can... Yeah, like this. Oh, ah, come on. Like this. Okay. Uh, the other station. You see, now we have a small station here. And I don't like it. Passenger building. Now I cannot add a large building here. Yep. So this is gone. I'm going to lose 100,000 here, but what can you do? Too much in a hurry. Okay, perfect. Ah, okay. <laughs> okay, so I have the two stations. Uh, what about Charlotte? Let's see. Okay. Um, uh, a little bit of a mess here, but I'm going to make make it work. So this is going to be commercial, I guess. Here. Uh, this is going to be residential. And this is going to be... Sorry, industrial, and this is going to be residential. Residential, I think, should be here. Yeah. Cool. All the stations are in place and only the trucks are replaced. Uh, no, and now here you can see the other mode for the trucks. Yes, number of trucks, you can add as many as you want. Some spacing as well. It's just beautiful. Okay, so first thing, uh, which one is that? Okay, that's Charlotte. So let's start by first starting very straight. 27, 26. No, actually, no. Here, I don't want to do this. Because here is where I have to do my switches. And there you go. It appears automatically. So, my trains are going to come from here. So, I want this one to be the speedy one. And this one can be a slow one. Oh, there you go. And then from here, I want to find 120. 120. Wait. 118, 120. Beautiful. Okay, so this one can go. And this one is ready, basically. Perfect. So now, uh, with the exception of you, now I can start making my turn. Uh, no, no turn. I can just go straight here. Because over here I'm going to make a turn. Okay, let's start from here. Make the same. Switches. Yeah, this is costing me some money, that's for sure. And as you can see, that's not cheating because it takes the money for creating the uh, rail. Uh, so coming from there, this has to be the slow one. So too much curvature. Done. And... Second one. 120, 120. There. So why am I doing this? I'm doing it because I don't want my trains to slow down to the uh, last possible moment. And I think it's going to continue forward up to here somewhere and then make a turn towards Savannah in the future or down to Tampa and Florida in general. Or... Maybe even start making the turn 
right now. So this is 160. So 480 is going to be one more up here and one on this side. Okay. Maybe I think I can start slowly making this turn like this. Can we make it cheaper? 34, 32, 31. Okay. There we go. And now turn this way. So that's still keeping it okay. 120. That's good enough. Yeah, 120. And continue. 120. And try to connect over here. 112,000. The good thing is that this is very flat. 220, 210. But still, yeah, I don't like this. No, this is too too much money. Pretty sure I can make it better. That's 54. 53, 46, 45, 43, 41, 40, 38, 37, 36, 33, 28. 28. 28. And that's 32. 31. 32. Saving money. 31. Okay. And that's 117 again here. Wants to 78. 76, 76. I think I saved some money for sure. Uh, it's inevitable to have to pay some. Okay, so the first track is laid down on the ground. Beautiful. Now, uh, signals. So, one way no, how to seek, yes. So, what I want to do is first add my signals here because they are in on this side and on the other side there you go and now see the magic that's also not cheating as you will see right now so that, let's start from here and as you can see i paid for them and remove this one and do the same on this side starting from here perfect and everything is ready for the trains. Now it's at 160, right? I didn't see actually. Oh, 500. Ow. Three. Ooh, ouch. <laughs> I fucked up. Uh, did I remove them? No. Backward, forward. I think I did this time. Okay, yeah. Sorry, sorry, my bad. Let's remove them because I did not set up correctly the... Okay, that one there should stay. I think it removed my signal here. Yes, and the spacing I want it to be 100, not 320. Okay. Let's add it again. Sorry about that. Yeah, did not add them. Because of reasons. There you go. Okay, that looks better now. And over here as well. Perfect. I just don't remember, did I delete this one? No, I didn't. Okay. And one last thing is the depot, I think. Which I don't know where to put for the moment. Let's see somewhere where it's fairly flat. This looks like a good place. <coughs> Buildings uh, depot. Let's add it here. There we go. Now we have one that comes over here, like this, and one that goes to the other 
site like this and the signals of course over here and over here perfect okay that cost me only two and a half million very good uh here i don't have the tram right nope where is it going to be buildings tram tram depot yeah uh let's put it no this i might want to expand that way well let's put it here for now i guess no i also don't like it here okay mm. yeah, i'll put it over here can we thank you put it farther away that so that we can expand the street in the future needs be and let's start with atlanta and building our lines so you always have to have some sort of uh, strategy. Line is public transportation, and then Atlanta. And now I'm going to add uh, a residential one because I might have more in the future. It's going to be from here to here. And also I'm going to use the green color because that's the residential color. It's going to help me in the future to see if I have any problems. This is good. The terminal can be the first one. Why not? Uh, oh, I also have terminals there. Yeah, of course. And... Okay, I guess this looks fine. Let's add another one from here to... Industrial, so it's going to be PT uh, Atlanta Industrial One. Let's put it at two and then give it all the other ones. And this is going to be, of course, yellow. Good. And another one from here to the commercial. And guess what? Public just station atlanta commercial one and guess what <laughs> it's going to be blue of course and this is three already and let's give it the other ones as well and everything looks perfect so now uh having this here in them because I really want to know where to upgrade. I'm going to take the upgrade to tram catenary. Yes. So here, 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 here. here. And here and now we can have electric trams everywhere perfect well, let's do it this is the electric one yep this <laughs> horse ones so let's buy one and what happened uh no Ah, you see? <laughs> I have a problem. There you go. Okay, now it's going to happen. Okay, commercial. Let's buy another one. Can I... Power. No. Yes. Buy one more. Add it to industrial. Buy one more. Add it to residential. Perfect. The setup for Atlanta is ready. Next thing is Charlotte. Yeah, it's a lot of setup this time. Uh, new line. 
from this was industrial what was it yes it's going to be pt and then char char should be enough or just charlotte okay and then uh, industrial one okay uh, let's start with one give it all and continue it's going to be commercial it's going to be pt d charlotte from one okay, it's going to be two and all the rest and one more it's going to be pt charlotte press one three already perfect and that's it so let's bring the upgrade tool i think i remember more or less here 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 all of that and here Ooh, and over here perfect that should make it work and by one commercial oh i didn't set the colors industrial and residential let's quickly do it so commercial should be blue industrial should be yellow and residential should be green amazing okay also this is going this is charlotte charlotte central i don't know what the sense is sightings but okay uh charlotte, charlotte north carolina nice this is Atlanta and this is Atlanta Central. Okay, perfect. Now I also have to buy a train for here. And my train is going to be Steam, yeah. I don't. What about war wagons? 80, 80 kilometers per hour. Okay. Which means. Oh, I'm going to lose this one soon, but matter uh, which means i don't need more than 75 yeah it's not that expensive oof this one is very very expensive i guess 60 uh difference is not big but this one is much more powerful has more uh has a higher top speed so i'm going to buy the mogo 260 at one passenger and buy it create our line and it's going to be from atlanta to charlotte let's put it on terminal one and also have the spare one as well and this is going to be inter city rail atlanta to Charlotte. Perfect. And I can play the game. See where that's going to lead us. This is at speed one. Perfect. We are in the game. My trams started moving. Let's see the train. The train is already here. Very, very slowly <laughs> moving through the forest. Okay, in the meantime, I have a ton of money. So I can do something with this food because it looks like a very good option. So this produces 200 and this needs two grain to produce one food. So I'm going to be able to produce 100 food maximum. Uh, yeah. I don't even have demand for that much, but it is what it is. And I don't think I like much for the food trucks to go through the main city. Uh, 
top of everything where I have to drop it off. So the food demand is all here, so I guess somewhere around here is the drop off. Yeah. yeah. That's going to be E. So I guess grain comes here and then the food goes there. So I think I prefer to create some connections over here. Yeah. I will need truck station platforms on each side. Yeah, for 200, maybe not that many. I think we can easily expand in the future. Uh, wait, that's a truck station. Why do I need tram trucks? Ah, because it can become both. Yeah, yeah, yeah. True. And I'm going to add it. Can I add it here and still have good enough connection? I think so. Uh, what happened here? Can we just connect these roads? Yeah, I think I really dislike this road over here. Yep. Let's try. Street. Um, yeah, it works. <laughs> okay. Good. Uh, well, while I'm doing this, why don't I just make some more connections? Save some money. 20. Ooh, yeah, yeah. Ooh, ooh. 16, 17. Okay. And then. Here. 32. 32. 32. Uh, minimum. Yep. Okay. So. I have to drop off there. So I think my station is going to be. Yeah centrally there because that looks like that most direct route yeah, so you make money by using direct routes so i can connect it like this but also have a connection from the other side to make my trucks connect from there um, yeah that looks fine let's add another connection over here and actually i don't think i even need this road. Let's connect uh, yep, directly here. Like this. 19, 17. Yep. Okay. That makes sense. So, uh, I also need one here, of course. This is going to be Well, yeah, okay, that happened without me wanting it to happen like this, but it's okay. Uh, yeah. It is what it is. So, I also need a road depot. Uh, oh, here is fine. Fine of a place. And five vehicles, cargo, all cargo. I need all cargo because I need... No, actually, I'm going to transport grain. These guys are coarse, <laughs> but these guys create much more emission. Uh, I can use the flatbed for the grain, although I don't understand why. They have exactly the same... Uh, properties how much is this how much cheaper is this 23,000 has a capacity of 5 this has a capacity of 6 40 years until 1915 it's a little bit faster and a little bit more capacity but twice the price and I'm pretty sure twice the money yeah uh, and it's still the 1900s. Cars were not that <laughs> uh, big of a deal in the 1900s. All cargo. Five. 
force drone, drone carriage with side sticks. I guess I can, especially with because of the emissions and they're going to be close to the city. These guys are just terrible. 61. I don't understand what the price is here because I cannot... Uh, 32. 32, 5,000. They're the same. This one is... 32, 5,000. They're all the same. Okay. I don't see why I don't use that cargo then. All 40 years. This one has 20 years. Yeah, but too much emissions. So let's use this one. I'm going to buy 10. Wait, 10. And I'm going to add them to my, uh, to a new line, which is going to be here, here. Start with one and one. And this is going to be all terminals. And this is going to be all terminals as well. And in the first one, I want full load. Thank you. So come here, bring me uh, the grain for food production. And then we're going to see what we do from there. And this is going to be cargo truck. And it's going to be Charlotte grain. Okay, and I have a bunch of money, so I'm going to repay much everything so that I don't pay a huge interest here. And I'm just going to take money when I need to. Okay, let's play the game and see how all the lines are going to do. The train is empty. Which is unfortunate. Okay, we already have some passengers gathering in our public transportation. Oh, here. I can, I think, very quickly make some purchases. Residential lines usually have a lot of traffic. Okay, we already have some people waiting here. Uh, what's my capacity? 16. Okay. Mm -hmm. Here's uh, vehicles. Let's copy out one more. Okay. This is doing good. Oh, 15, 16. Oh, yeah, yeah. I think it's time for expanding. Need some money, of course. There you go. That's two. Two of them now. Perfect. Uh, let's repay here. I don't need to pay money. Uh, yeah, for now everything is in the negative. It is what it is. Okay, we have uh, a good amount of grain here. And we are producing food at this point. So I will pause real quick and add one line from here and a drop off there i really don't care again for the terminals here so why why don't i put this in the fort and i don't have any and the other line is going to be on the first without the fort let's make it like this and i am going to by two of those. I'm going to assign them to this line and play. And in the meantime, rename it to cargo truck Atlanta Food Drop. Okay. Looks good. Look at these animations. How food is produced. In the 1900s, very mechanically, <laughs> with a lot of machinery in this factory. Okay, how are we doing? Some things are coming to the positive. 
the train not that much although this is going to be the the best best line of all 30 passengers yeah should be enough um, here here i guess three is not enough okay let's try with four a lot of passengers waiting why not one two okay here as well 22 let's give them four not enough money you can always help with that okay here i'm having 29 and the train is coming i don't think i need another wagon yet i think i have a capacity of okay maybe i will let's edit it add one more it's expensive things man there you go i don't want to leave any passengers waiting yeah pick them all up take all the yellow people from the station yeah 40 40 good uh grain is stacking up here or not I think we're looking good. Three foot. Okay. Cool. And 30 people are waiting here. For our beautiful train. Yay! Choo choo! Beautiful game. Okay. 42 people. I think I have 48 capacity. Great. Uh, this station is always going to have some people. Uh, here we're looking good. Yeah, I think I added too many vehicles on this one. Uh, 7 out of 7, 7, 7, 0. Let's sell this one. Yes. Alright. Oh, oh yeah. I think... I think we will need, I don't know, let's say three more. Good. This is going up. Just in case, I'm going to add one cargo building here because I do not want to lose grain. And yeah, we are growing 68. It was 50 something before. Beautiful. 29 people waiting here. Okay, this is this is going very well. I can take a bunch more money and try to set up something more. And why not Washington DC? Yeah, looks promising. I don't like this water though, that's for sure. Why not? Here, some food production. They both want food. That's very, very good. We can set up a road. Or do I want to connect them actually by car? That's a good question. That looks actually very interesting. I don't see why I don't do that. Uh, these two cities. No, I prefer to connect them by rail. Uh, so my rail station here is going to be over here and the one here this side I guess and the rail is going to go through here like that which means I can set up the food production so grain to the food food back and then another truck is going to pick it up to Miami and here the same I guess and not connect them by uh, by road i think i like that by the way road i am paying maintenance roads i don't understand why i'm paying for maintenance of roads since everything i have given up the ownership of everything maintenance infrastructure. that's the rail i think no this is the rail this is the I don't know. 
I guess some of the roads are still considered mine. They are old. Oh, I think he's in red. Anyway, let's continue with the plan. Uh, where is Florida? Florida. Okay, so very quick setup from here to here. Oh, actually direct. Yeah, I know it's not beautiful, but it's going to make more money 16, 14 over time. 15. And this one be like that. 32. 32 was the best. Okay. And one common station, I believe. So that's going to be a lot of trucks, so let's make it big. Truck station. Oh, money. Yep, of course. Let's make it big. So I'm going to have trucks coming from the right here. And tr trucks leaving as well. So let's make it like this. Yeah. And then I'm going to do... Uh, street access. So I want the people coming from here to come to here and exit from here. And the guys coming from there to that and exit like that. And let's remove this one. That's going to help the flow of traffic with the exception, of course, of this tiny connection here. It's ugly, but what can you do? Actually, maybe I can improve this one. Too much slow. There you go. Built anyway. That's the thing. Yeah, I know. Actually, I'm curious why this happens. It's not supposed to happen. This was supposed to take the same uh, height. Anyway, so that has to make these guys come from here and leave from here. Especially... If I delete this one. Okay. So. Uh, so if I bring the food here and then from here I bring it there. That means I need a bigger station over here as well. So let's make that happen. Buildings. I. Sometimes I don't click the shift. So if you click the shift button and then you start uh, moving your mouse, you can adjust the positioning of the buildings. That's what I'm doing. And sometimes I don't press the shift fast enough. I think that's very wide. Yeah. I'm going to destroy this. And then I'm going to add this right here. Come on, right here, okay. So now I'm going to do the same. Configure the entrance to be... Actually, let's first remove this. And then the entrance is going to be okay, here. And the exit is going to be there. I can do another entrance, I guess. No, that's fine. And another one. Collision. Amazing. Ah, like this. Okay. And there has to be one axis here. And this one has to go to Tampa. So let's make it work. Tampa directly. Why not? 23, 21. I saw 21. Okay. And here, building, unload. Uh, okay, very centrally, right over here. Uh, let's do the same for Miami. 
Uh, not very nice. Again, it's going to be very central over here. And I actually have to do exactly the same over here by taking a little bit more money as well. And set up the station here as well. Like this. This is going to be uh, the entrance is going to be from here and the exit is going to be actually it can be in the center as well I don't know. if it want to work but it doesn't in the center for reasons I actually don't care it would be here I will see later how it exactly the lines want to do things ah and let's not forget of course I need the connection on the other side and that seven five five okay five is good enough okay um that's good i like it i think though in this situation i will need two depots and i don't mind to be honest but one here There, maybe not, but there we go. And now lines. So one is going to come from here to here. In the first station, it's going to use one. Uh, six and five and four and three. Okay. And that's good. And here I want two load because it's going to pick up the grain. And in the other station is going to unload in six, five or four. And here load if available. Correct. Okay, and this is going to be Actually I'm not sure if this one so this is two hundred and two hundred so I can produce two hundred food so I think in general in the future only one of the cities is going to have uh all the food from this production. So I will start. Yeah. They're going to be cargo truck and it's going to be Miami. Rain. Food. That means that picks up the grain and then drops the food. Uh, so Miami has a demand of 79, and, but that's going to increase probably. And this one has 47. Okay. Uh, that's going to change in the future. But yeah, for now, let's do it. And... One more line. This one is going to be from here to here. And in the first one, let's do the things on that side. So let's do one, two, three, and four, and full load. And on the other place, let's make it one, two, and three, right? One, two, and three. Yeah. Okay. And let's call this city this one was tampa tampa grain food amazing and i just need to add from here to here i probably should have given it more this is going to be six and five and on the other station, I don't care. And this one is going to be full load as well. And this is going to be cargo truck. Tampa would drop. Okay. Uh, did I give it? Yeah, four. Yeah, I acted it properly. And one last. Uh, here, I think I didn't give it enough. Eh. Fine. 
and this is going to be uh, one and two and two load and this is going to be city miami boot drop okay so buying vehicles uh same 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 stuff buy one and go to miami food drop let's see if i can buy one and set it to tampa food drop yeah it can go that's good so i didn't need the second let's refund it and then let's buy uh let's buy 10 and put it to Miami Green Food and let's buy 10 more and add it to no money and add it to Tampa Green Food. All right, that looks very good. This is probably going to produce some money, at least some. Uh, let's play it. Come on, horse cards. Go and pick up my grain. Oh. Okay. Always repay so that you don't pay loans. Interest on loans. 43, that's looking good. Maybe we reach the equilibrium. Yeah, I think the train just came. Here is 33 and the train is coming, 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 coming. Cool. That's fine because the train just dropped them off and now the trams have to pick them up. Let's see how we're doing here. Hmm. This one is not making me enough money. I mean, I don't want them to make me a lot, but at least not to lose. That would be nice. Maybe three is too much? Or it's not too much when there is people waiting. <laughs> I don't know. So this tram is here. Picked up seven people. And yeah, maybe just sometimes it's in the negative. That one looks good. Okay. Atlanta is looking good as well. Okay. So... Everything is looking good so far. I think uh, we've made a great amount of progress for a first episode. I like it a lot. We will see what's happening here in the next episode. I will hope to see you there.